Happy Friday. Something that I think is massively overlooked when we're trying to reach our goals is the way that we think, the way that we go about our days, the way we look at other people, the stuff that goes through your head. Um, when I've had the most amount of success in weight loss, I've had the most amount of clarity in my mind. I wasn't thinking about other people. I wasn't worried about what they were doing. Um, unless it was something where I was, you know, thinking, you know, how I could help someone or how, you know, um, honored I was to know them and be around them and have a chance to gain wisdom and information from them and just being happy for others. But I didn't spend a lot of time thinking about other people or worried about other people unless it was like my son, my partner, my family, my friends. And it's, you know, fruitful thoughts. It's helpful thoughts. It's how can I assist these people thoughts, you know, or thinking about what it is that they're doing in their life that I can apply to my own and enrich my ability to move forward in a positive way. Um, being an endomorph is difficult. I talk about that all the time. It's, it's very difficult. And I touch on this behavior thing all the time. Well, part of the, part of the behavior is your daily thought process. You know, when you roll out of bed in the morning, how do you feel? Do you feel like you're going to be able to eat the right foods all day? Do you feel like you're going to be able to, um, if you're intermittent fasting, or do you feel like you're going to be able to, you know, uh, carry through with that um, uh, eating window that you've, you know, said that you're going to stay within? Um, you know, who knows? Only you know that. But I can tell you this, that if you want huge success when it comes to controlling your behavior, you are going to have to find a way to have elite level thinking, higher level thinking. You're going to have to leave the negative speak and the negative thinking about others, you know, out of your life. That kind of stuff has to go because and, and that's the reason why I started talking about, you know, this stuff rather than all the other stuff that I was talking about before I switched over to, you know, the endomorph life stuff, because you don't want negativity in your mind. You know, even if, and, and the thing about it is, is even when you're thinking about things that may be growth related or whatever, you know, make them positive. Don't think about, oh, this person's doing that, this person's doing that. I mean, you know, you can reflect, but don't spend much time worried about other people. You know, don't don't spend much time worried about other people. Don't don't care whether they're doing what you wouldn't do or doing what you don't want to do or the way that they're treating you. Don't even worry about that kind of stuff. You, you can't think about that kind of stuff and, you know, have, you know, goals flying into your life. It's not gonna happen, you know. And if you're tr if if you're um, if your body fat's high, and you're trying to have a lean physique, if you don't have those genetics, which endomorphs don't, then you have a very difficult road ahead of you. You really don't have time to be thinking about anyone else. And the thing is, is that I don't look at this all the time, you know, from a you know, I talk about being lean, different things like that, but there's more to it than being lean. It's about your health. You know, when I think about being lean, I think about uh, the ability with a back injury to go hike Mount Sai without having to deal with a lot of pain. With all the excess fat on my body, I can't do that because I'm carrying around weight that, you know, in my mass, the max load on my back is higher. If I have less fat, even if I have more, you know, equal level, even if I decided to recomp, 
you know all that muscle that in, increased muscle is supporting my back is supporting my injury you know you know high blood pressure you know eating meats eating dairy eating all these different things that endomorphs really should stay away from you know you have to think about that kind of stuff you don't have time to think about what everyone else is doing you know focus on you focus on that goal focus on what is it going to take for me to be the best me you know and then you know use the rest of your time to think about like I said before how you can help others how you can enrich others lives you know ponder on the things that you see other people doing in their life you know well ponder on other successes you know what what can you learn from watching what they're doing how are they getting you know uh, magnificent levels of success how are they doing incredibly well in their life Look at it from that perspective. You know, you see all these people out here, like negatively speaking of other successes. Don't be that person. Be the person that, you know, is, you know, thinking about others in a fruitful and honorable way. You know, think about others as if you walk around and there's a bubble above your head and your thoughts can be seen by everyone around you. A huge bubble. Happy Friday.